Just as the fog rolls in, the team sets off from Everett, Washington to complete function and reliability testing, where they'll put the airplane through more airline situations. It should be a breeze compared to what the 787 test fleet has already been through. Boeing put one Dreamliner into a refrigerated hangar to see if it can start up at minus 45 degrees. On the runway, pilots put the tail down on the ground to measure how slowly the 787 can take off. They slammed on the brakes while the jetliner was speeding down the runway to simulate the ultimate rejected takeoff. In the air, pilots flew the 787 at the lowest possible speed, then up to almost the speed of sound. They purposely put one Dreamliner through hundreds of stalls to make sure it can recover in such an emergency. In other flights, some of the most extreme loads were placed on the airplane to test for flutter. Upon landing, the 787 had to handle fierce crosswinds, wet runways, or just fly repeated passes to test for ground effects.